Cancer. Welcome to your July reading. Okay. So we have the Nine of uh, Pentacles and also the Two of Pentacles in reverse. Hmm. It seems like there's going to be something this month. Also the Page of Pentacles in reverse. I'm getting this month there's something that kind of knocks you off balance. Um, kind of knocks you off like a, it's kind of like something kind of catches you by surprise in your life, like a certain area that you were not expecting to catch you by surprise. Um, and I'm not getting into anything too bad, but you're just kind of like, whoa. Um, it causes you to have an awakening about something um, and maybe take action in a certain way that you wouldn't have. It's weird, I'm getting this sense of feeling like on edge, something like this. Um, yeah, and so once this thing kind of knocks you, it almost like once you get something kind of knocks you off balance, it almost wakes you up and makes you be present this month that you're like, oh, like you're all of a sudden like alert because you're like something changed, something shifted, and so you have to adjust accordingly. Um, so it kind of makes you a lot more alert, a lot more present and like understanding like what areas you need to take action. Hmm. Also, with this high priestess in reverse, and like, um, it's almost like this couldn't have been revealed to you unless this caught you off guard, unless, uh, unless you're kind of knocked off balance in this way. It, like, you needed to be waking up from something, and like, not be so passive in a certain situation, not be so, um, yeah, to not expect something. And I'm not thinking it's like you like. Uh, it's not anything like too bad, it's just that you, yeah, you need to be, uh, this is just something that you're like, okay, this is just going to keep going, how it's going, I don't need to do anything with this, I don't need to, you know, like this will be fine, kind of without you doing anything, but then all of a sudden something shifts and it's like, you know, you need to continue to nurture this and take action with this. Also with this like commit card here, it's like this thing requires your commitment, and so maybe it's not something that you always need to um, maintain all the time. You don't need to put like so much energy into it always, but it's still, um, you recognize how this was something that kept your life in balance, and so you need to keep like recommitting to it. It's not just gonna go on its own. Interesting. Hmm. Okay, also with this Inspire card and this Milk and Honey card, and also to be fair, there's like here about like balance, and you're like, oh, this was actually, it's almost like you didn't realize how much you needed this thing, how much it brought you balance in some way. Um, yeah. But I'm getting this month, um, you might find some new sense of joy, some new sense of inspiration that you didn't, it's almost like you're getting in touch with something that really makes you happy, that brings you a lot of joy. And also I'm getting uh, this kind of presence that you have, it almost wakes you up and so you start feeling a bit more inspired, you start feeling a bit more like you want to take action in certain areas and also like this presence helps you to appreciate some really sweet, beautiful things that are going on in your life as well. Um, so yes, thank you Cancer, that's all I have for you, I hope that you enjoyed this reading. If you like a personal reading, please email me, the email for that's in the description of this video. Thank you.